This way, Loki of the Jotnar. Wait, hey, is that Gjallarhorn? Are you Heimdall? Obviously. Now feel free to drink in the splendor of Asgard. This is a rare sight for outsiders. Especially giants. Yes. Why not steal anything that is not nailed down? That is sure to impress your hosts. Oh. Done drinking it in already. Cornerstone of civilization in the Nine Realms, not really your cup of tea. I see. Oh, uh... <sighs> Just ask your questions already. How'd you know I had questions? It is my job. Next question. What is your job? I protect the realm I love from trouble. And you think I'm trouble? You just met me. And I can already see you are eager to prove yourself. Way too eager. Probably due to an overshadowing father figure you can never live up to. Good guess. I would also guess that you are... disrespectful. Entitled and... impulsive. You don't know me at all. I help people. Oh! You are here to help people. Hmm. No. No. You are here to help yourself. To manipulate and lie to whoever you have to to get what you want. I know you're young. Your voice probably dropped while you were climbing the wall, but... <laughs> what a twisted little soul you have. <laughs> you are chaos in a spiffy archer suit. I watch your mouth move, and I see cities burning. Nothing good is going to come from you being in Asgard. That said, if you are here to aid the Allfather and have no treacherous intent, I guess that makes us allies. Gultopper. Who loves me the most? Who loves me the most? Wow, that's almost as impressive as Balder taming a dragon. Balder had the luxury of not caring how badly he got burnt. I outthink them. Dominate them fair and square. these all Aesir gods? What? You think all Aesir are gods? But Skilder told me that only... Oh, well, if Skilder told you, clearly whoever that is must be the authority on Aesir gods, not the Aesir god you are currently talking to. You literally know nothing of our culture, do you? I know lots of things. I know a giant built that wall. A giant built the wall that keeps out the giants. Primther, son of Thalmor. I know the whole story. Really? I truly cannot wait for you to regale me with the revisionist tales of Asgard's architectural history. Is that Odin's palace? Palace? Do you think the Allfather needs to puff himself up like some mortal chieftain? I guess not. That is the Great Lodge which the Allfather built with his own hands. I'm sorry if that is a letdown for you. Real power, you see, does not need to flaunt. It emerges when the time is right. Don't you agree? Ha! Hey! Whoa! <laughs> hey, Helmets! I brought you a practice time. I thought we were going to Odin. You see, the thing is, you do have treacherous intent. So I am not letting you anywhere near the Allfather. That is your big special move. Hilarious. Cowboy. Yeah! 
boring. Guess who's next? You sure you want to keep on bother waiting? Funny thing, I am sure about that. Yes, I am feeling very sure, matter of fact. Oh, that one felt special. I hope that was not the last trick you had. You're not gonna stop me from seeing Odin. You'll be seeing him from your grave. What? That doesn't even make sense. You were counting on that to protect you? Guess those arms could not lift a real shield. Sure, completely ineffective, so keep doing. Is that it? Is this all you have to show me, Yotin? Wow. I do have to say, Loki, I am profoundly unimpressed. You should probably stay down. <laughs> Knock it off. Like it or not, he's all father's guest. But I thought I smelled something. Take one more step, you're not gonna like how this ends. Really? And how do you intend to stop me? Look into my eyes. You tell me. You are a sick man. Loki! You made it! I am so honored. I, I see you've met Heimdall. He reads minds for me. The boy... It's false, our father. This young man, who is my guest, is covered in mud. Care to explain? He means to betray you. <gasps> is that true, Loki? You a little trickster? Uh... I'm just messing around. Of course he means to betray me, huh? Heimdall? Why else would he come? I've given him no reason to trust me. Not yet. But he's got some very big questions. And I have so many answers to give. What are you up to? Dismissed. Go. Gladly. And you, clean yourself up. Let off of it. Oh, my... See, uh, Heimdall, will you just relax? Were you intending on killing me first thing? See? What, that's not good enough for you? Get out of here. <laughs> He's a lot, I know. Very perceptive, but sometimes he just forgets to think, you know? Hey, I got some places to be. So how'd your father take the news that you decided to accept my invitation? I... Not well, huh. <laughs> Can't blame him. Between my ex-wife and my disgruntled former employee, he's not exactly getting an unbiased view. But you, you're curious, open-minded. That's important. Reist, Meist, carry on. Pretend I'm not here. If I'm being honest with you, Loki, you're lucky my offer still stands after you went and sprung tear. But I suppose spending time with him is punishment enough, isn't it? You would have been dead. <laughs> At least Mimir never lost his sense of humor. But look, it, that's all behind us now. I like to keep looking forward. Hey, hey, hey! I want them trained, not decapitated. Just keep it below the neck, all right? Is that really what you do when I'm not here? All father. Queen Gana. The Ainhoyar are ready for your blessings. That's why I'm here, isn't it? Hmm. 
Yes, there's a new Valkyrie thing. Great soldiers, these ain't hairy are, but they tend to come out of Valhalla a little foggy. I do what I can for them, help them remember who they were in life. That's important, don't you think? A sense of identity gives things meanings. Moon be nothing, Hrothgar. Moon be nothing, Worm. Moon be nothing, Yana. Okay, next up. Ah, the books. Good. Those are for him. I understand you're an avid reader. These are just a few things from my personal collection. Uh, thanks. Jurgen, those better not be mushrooms, I smell. Listen, I appreciate your offer, but I'm really not sure what you're expecting from me. Right now, you're just visiting, Loki. One step at a time. Steady there, Carl. But with all respect, you need to know. I came to study, not to serve. Another servant is the last thing I need. I need someone with drive, with curiosity. Someone will take initiative. That looks good. Is that braised? But why me? Is it because I'm half giant? Big deal. So's Thor. Erland, try to stay awake for me. OK, but. Look, don't overthink it. I have a project I think you'll be interested in, a major learning opportunity. For both of us. What about my family? My friends? I need to know nobody's gonna get hurt. Why would I hurt anybody? A truce is all I've been asking for from the start, if you recall. Look, you're here now. Stop worrying. It's all gonna be fine. Almost to your room. My room? Yep, just over here. Feel free to come and go. Take what you need, poke around as you please. You're not my prisoner. And more importantly, I'm not your father. All father, there's a situation that needs your attention. Sif, you missed welcoming our new house guest. Say hello to Loki. This is him? Here. In our home. How nice. My diplomat. Everything all right in New Midgard? The refugees are fine. The situation is with the dwarves. You know who is back. Yeah, it's always something. Put those books down. We got another stop to make. Uh, sure. Yeah. All right. I'm here. Where is he? He? Oh, he, uh, just over there. All oh, Father. Sir. Uh. Chief, it's been too long. What's the issue now? No issue at all if you're trying to build volatile death traps. I approve these designs personally, and not all that recently, I might add. Did you just wake up with the urge to be a pain in my ass? Yeah. Who's the cut? You're training pockets. You know what, Durlin? You reek of cheap mead, and that is by far your most endearing characteristic. Now listen up. It's me, your entire economy, speaking. I want you to know that I have confidence in you, confidence you can deliver me these machines as promised on time, on budget, and of course, safely. The dwarves have never let me down, and they're not about to start now. Right? Good. Okay, son. I'm gonna let you catch your breath. When you're ready to get to work and start getting those answers, meet me in my study down the hall. Oh and help yourself to a change of clothes.
Guess I could try this on. It has less mud on it anyway. Whoa, I can use this. Huh, nicely equipped. What needs work? Whoa! Loki, right? Gotta say, the irony of this isn't lost on me. This was his room, you know? His? My brother's. Your brother? Modi? Ah, oh, your brother. Really? I had no idea. Uh-huh. And now it's yours. Enjoy. Fruit thirst, Doctor. Relax. You got some pretty small shoes to fill. We're better off without him, Loki. Trust me. Walk with me. Uh, don't forget your sword. <clears throat> uh, someone will clean that up. So, uh, what kind of sword is that? It's new. One of a kind. My father gave it to me for Valkyrie training. You're in Valkyrie training? Got time to talk about it? I was just heading to the Great Hall. But if you need to go to work, grandfather's study is just down those stairs. 
Fair enough. Come say hi when you're back. Catch you later. Yes, I, I, I understand. Yes. Do you see me nodding and saying, yes, I understand? I... I... Uh-huh. Yes. Yes, all right. Mm-hmm. Uh, you see, th this is you not letting me talk. No, Hugan, I, I don't need my ears clean. I need you to stop croaking and 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 accept the answer you know I'm about to give. I was just looking at this. I don't think. I've had that since, huh, who can remember? <laughs> you, you have a name? Ingrid. Really? Sure, why not? Take it, if you like it that much. For real? Consider it a perk of the job. Thank you. I mean, really. And they say I'm the bad guy. Come on, let's walk. Everyone's got me all wrong. You think war drives me or power, wealth? Nah, never have. You know what drives me? What I really want? I want answers. Same as you. See, mortals have it easy. When they push up against life's big questions, they can look to us to give them meaning, divine comfort. <laughs> we both know that's a sham. But when we have questions, why are we here? To give meaning to mortals while living without it ourselves? No. We're more than that. And I found something that proves it. What is it? It's what drives me. You feel it, don't you? Feels like... knowledge. Truth. All truth. All the answers. We could find out why we're here, learn how to change our fates, stop Ragnarok for good, maybe? Save the people we love. How? I was a young god when I found it. Spent lifetimes studying it, following every clue down every dead end, looking for and finally unearthing this. You see that? It shares the same mystical energy. It opened a crack. Can we just look inside? I wouldn't recommend that. What's the broken mask for? You recognize any writing on it? These aren't from the Nine Realms. Smolder. Obsidione Spitha. From smoldered earth and obsidian spark, and a field of battles never fought. Are you certain? Because if that's a clue, I know what it means. And what's that? Keep working with me and find out. You don't have to kill anyone. You don't have to betray your father or yourself. Come on, I know you felt what I felt. The answers are in there. Let's get them. I mean, you translated this language like it was nothing. If I do help you, what's next? Thor, get down here. All father. Don't do that. What's next is chasing this down. Take this and this stealthy side of beef and see where it takes you. I don't promise anything. Nonsense. Happy hunting. And you, 
Go easy on him, you hear me?